If you watch US Netflix on your Amazon Fire Stick, it's actually very simple. So to do this, we need to trick Netflix into thinking we are viewing it from that specific country. And that's where we need a VPN, also known as a virtual private network. So to get a VPN on our Amazon Fire Stick, the first thing we need to do is to make sure we are on the homepage. Once here, you want to scroll all the way across to the app drawer on the right, and you want to scroll all the way down to where it says get more apps and click on that. This will take you to the Amazon Fire Stick application store. From here, we need to search for the VPN. So you want to go to the left to the search tab, and then you want to click on the search bar here. So the VPN I recommend using is called Private Internet Access. So once you search for Private Internet Access, it will be the first result and it will look like this. So you want to go ahead and click into it and it will tell you more about Private Internet Access VPN and what it will do. So you just want to go ahead and install Private Internet Access from here. And once you've done that, you want to go ahead and open up the VPN. So once you've opened the VPN, it will look like this and you'll be greeted to a login screen. So you want to go ahead and click on the login button and you want to go ahead and log into your account. Now, because you're watching this video, I'm going to assume you don't have an account. So you will need to click on the link in the description of this video and it will take you to the website where you can go ahead and register for an account. I recommend you use Private Internet Access VPN as they have hundreds of high speed servers all around the world, which is exactly what you need when you're watching high definition content. What's also great is that they have a no logs policy, which means all of the encrypted data you use through the VPN will not be tracked or stored. So you can rest assured that you are safe and anonymous online. So once you've entered your account information, you want to go ahead and log into your account. So once you've logged in, the VPN application will look like this and it's very easy to use. So what we need to do now is to select a VPN server from anywhere around the world. In this case, we want to watch US Netflix, so we need to select a US server. So I'm going to scroll all the way down here until I find the US servers. And once you've found the US servers, you want to select the one with the lowest number below it, because the lower the number, the less latency you have and the better performance you will get. So in this case, I've got this Kentucky one at 120 milliseconds. All you need to do is to click on the server and within a few seconds it will say VPN connected which means you are now connected to that VPN server which means you are now browsing the internet from the country you selected in this case the United States. If you wish to manually connect or disconnect from a server all you need to do is click on the power button at the very top. So once we are connected to our server of choice all we need to do is go back to our dashboard and then you want to go to the streaming platform of your choice. In this case we are going to use Netflix. So once we've loaded Netflix, we need to restart the application in order to get it to recognize we are from a different country. So to do this, you want to go to the side menu, and then you want to scroll all the way down to the get help menu and click on that. From here, it will say country slash language, and it currently says GB because I'm currently in Great Britain. However, we connected to the US server. So we need to scroll all the way down to where it says reload Netflix, and you want to click on that. And now I've reloaded Netflix, it now thinks I'm in the VPN server country. So if I go back to the get help menu, as you can see where it says country slash language, it says US because I'm now on the United States version of Netflix, where I can go ahead and start watching movies just as I normally would. And that is how you watch US Netflix on your Amazon Fire Stick. Remember to click on the link in the description in order to register for private internet access. So if this video is helpful, please leave a like and pass on to someone who may find it helpful as well. And if you have any questions or comments, you can leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as I can.